With control dashboard reporting, you can easily get from a macro view to a micro view. If I click dashboards, I'll see you know my home dashboard, network dashboard, user experience. Um, but let's start with this home dashboard. From this home dashboard, I can see that I have these devices all over the world, and I can kind of see some overall health of that. But I can zoom in to a certain area, certain devices. So here I am zooming into this couple devices in Canada. I see I have. But I have three over there and two over there and if I really drill down I can even get to the device name and click it and get a micro view of that of that machine's health and information. I can also take a look at my overall network usage and network health of all the devices in my environment. I can look at my user experience uh, dashboard or even like a unified communication and collaboration dashboard. I can also look at some very micro view of reports. For instance, like a hardware and operating system report. I can look at some host files. I can look at top processes. And this is top ISPs. Okay, I can even take a look at you know Windows or top disk usage. I could look at Windows apps and processes, maybe application statistics I want to take a look at. These are all just coming to me so fast. I can look at average memory usage. Look at Zoom's taking 191 megabytes. Uh, I can take a look at you know, top processes. Uh, I can take a look at performance and security. So here's missing patches that are out there. I can take a look at user profiles. I can even look at some detailed information on unified communications. I can look at custom reports and even some end user activity reports. These are really easy to look at a macro and micro view of all the data that's out there in my environment.